Trainer with LG Mobilecom. What I'm talking about today right now is the LG Optimus Black. The LG Optimus Black, just like the 2X, is one of our global devices that will be appearing globally, you know, soon, sometime. Uh, unfortunately, can't talk about when, but, you know, stay tuned. We'll talk about that. But the great thing about the Optimus Black is the screen brightness. As you see here, we're talking about, a lot of people don't know that we make the Retina display for the iPhone. Um, then, of course, we're also showing off the Galaxy S display. Now, the great thing about the Optimus Black is as bright as you see it right now, it will literally be this bright in direct sunlight. So you could be at the beach, at your favorite vacation home, outside with the kids, playing around at the beach, and still be able to be productive by seeing your device and not have to tilt it back and forth to try and see it in direct sunlight. We're using a 700 nit brightness to make it that bright in an IPS LCD instead of an AMOLED or an OLE, OLED, OLED um, LCD to make that magic happen. One of the great things about it that I love about the Optimus Black, people always talk about, you know, I don't want to put fingerprints all over my touchscreen phone. Well, it actually has a, not a six axis like the PlayStation 3 controller, it has a nine axis controller. So all I do is I press down the button here on the left hand side of the phone. All I can do is if I tilt my hand, I go ahead and do that, button, if I tilt my hand, it will scroll the screen left and right. So you can hold it this way so you guys can get it. Yeah. So I can move around on my different home screens just by moving the phone. Unfortunately, right now, this is a prototype, but what we're shooting for upon release is different things, let's say like even a notification screen, being able to flip my phone this way and put a notification screen to drop down. So this is a new technology that uh, we are you know, releasing on the Optimus Black. So well, another thing that's great about the Optimus Black, I guess we should probably cut there so I can move over there. Another thing that's great about the Optimus Black is something that's called Wi-Fi Direct. With Wi-Fi Direct, it gives you the capability of moving not just pictures and video. A lot of people talk about DLNA, of course. Wi-Fi Direct is a technology that DLNA uses to distribute content to a TV. So with Wi-Fi Direct, I can not only do video, pictures, of course movies, but I can also even move document files over to my Optimus Black in such a fast speed. I mean, speeds right now are looking at uh, 802.11n, 30 megabits per second, 802.11g, and 30 megabits per second. So whether that be two Wi-Fi direct devices or pulling in information from another Wi-Fi source, I can pull that information in very easily. So both the Optimus Black and the Optimus 2X that we talked about are both Android Froyo devices. Um, right now, we're not talking about if they're going to be, um, you know, 2.3 Android, but you know, they're going to release Android Froyo, or we're going to release on Android Froyo. And as you see, which I didn't show in the Optimus 2X, we're using some of our own customized UI. Take a look at our notification screen. Everything is right here for you. Same thing on the Optimus 2X. You've got great clarity screen, best clarity screen on the Optimus Black, but with the notification screen you see here, your music controls are right there for you. Being able to to move around from turning off 3G if you ever wanted to, I don't know why you would, but turning on Bluetooth, turning on and off Wi-Fi, or even your cellular connection is right there for you. So, introducing LG Optimus Black. Great job.